Kerala Paradox, large vaccine footprint, but new infections raised India's COVID caseload. Over the last two days, Kerala has reported a significant rise in new infections, which has led to an increase in active cases at the national level for the first time in two months. Kerala has been discovering between 11,000 and 13,000 cases every day for almost a month now. During the same period, the daily count in the country has halved. From more than 80,000 a day to about 40,000 a day. Nearly every major state other than Kerala has reported a significant decline in the daily case count. Since June 15, Kerala has been the biggest contributor to the national case load. For the last two days, the state has accounted for more than a third of all cases reported in the country. At the peak of the second wave, Kerala was contributing less than 10% of all cases in the country. At that time, Kerala was contributing almost half of all cases on some days. At that time too, Kerala's curve hit an extended plateau on its downward journey in a way the first wave never ended in Kerala. The state had continued to report 5,000 to 6,000 cases every day, when even Maharashtra saw its daily count fall to about 2,000. Almost the same thing is happening now. Over 30 lakh people have been infected in Kerala so far. A number that is second only to Maharashtra's, Kerala has recorded more than 90,000 cases per million population, almost four times India's overall number of about 24,000. Kerala has been finding almost 13 infections per 100 tests in Uttar Pradesh. This figure is under three. When a person tests positive, we all test close contacts of that person, family members, etc. Kerala has ramped up testing from about 50,000 to 60,000 per day in the middle of April to over a lakh now, and sometimes crosses 1.5 lakh samples a day. Tamil Nadu, Karnataka and Bihar too are testing around 1.5 lakh samples daily. We have reached a plateau as far as active cases are concerned and the fall would be slow. The recent unlocking has contributed to a spike in cases, but we hope that the curve will come down. We had anticipated the present situation, she said. This is better than Maharashtra or Tamil Nadu. As of now, Kerala is the only major state where active cases are rising. In the last one week, the active cases count in the state has increased by over 7,000. As of Wednesday, there were 1.08 lakh active cases in the state, second only to Maharashtra's 1.14 lakh. But unlike Kerala, Maharashtra is seeing is steady though slow decline in its active cases numbers. Some northeastern states, notably Tripura and Arunachal Pradesh, do have reporting active cases. But their numbers are very small compared to Kerala's or Maharashtra's.